Hi, it's me again with Corel Draw Tips and Tricks. And somebody's trying to draw a cube, and then they want to put a, like an A on it or baby blocks. And uh, so I'm trying to help them. And the, the easiest way I've found to draw a cube, you can use the extrude tool, but why not use the polygon tool, six-sided, hold down the control button and make it perfect. Get the two-point line and go from each corner to each corner. And make sure you're on your nodes. You'll actually see it say node. Then just take your virtual segment malik key and delete every other corner. There's your block. Now, to add perspective, this is not, you know, it's just a three lines in a polygon, so you need to take your smart fill tool and fill that in. Then you can move it over and it's all one piece, left click, right click, and then just type out your letter and you don't have to particularly do anything to it. Let's make it a little bit smaller. And what you could do also, let's do this. Do it the right way. Let's go to effects, contour. Let's contour to the inside 0.25 of an inch. That'll give us a reference point. Now let's move our A in here. Let's make our A a little bit smaller. And what that's gonna do is keep it off the edge. Now grab your A and go up to effects or go up to object and add perspective. And then you could take your corners and put it in that corner of your new block. And then all you have to do is nudge it over. And there's your A and you do the B the same thing or whatever graphic or whatever you're gonna have on there. Let's make that block a little thicker so you might be able to see it in the video a little bit better. We could actually go eight points. Now we're done. That's one way I would do it. Hope that helped a little bit. Thank you for watching.